I've always wondered what the difference was between a holiday ale and a normal ale. We're in Pioneer Square at the Holiday Ale Festival. Let's go ask the experts and let's get some beer. So if you've been watching PD Exposed, you know that we've hooked up with Kurt Woodmere. Now we complete the circle, we've got his brother Rob. What is this beer? We, we brew a, a beer called uh, Northwest Red. We've done it for some festivals. And the guys, uh, typically what you do, with, especially with the Winter Ale Fest, is maybe amp it up a bit. So a little more malt, a little more hops, a little more alcohol, a good winter warmer. And they wanted to come up with a name, so Regifted Red is kind of fitting. This thing has grown and grown. So this is the 11th annual. T talk about that. It's it's an awesome festival. Um, um, we were talking earlier, we got the Oregon Brewers Festival in August, and then we have the Holiday Ale Fest now, and it's just an, it's an awesome time to come out. You know, we've got the Christmas tree up, you know, it's the Portland's, Portland's tree. Here we are in Portland's living room, you know, enjoying beer and camaraderie, and it's just, you know, everybody's full of Christmas spirit. It's Christmas, next comes New Year's. What's your New Year's resolution? Oh, man. <laughs> I don't know. Brew more good beer, drink more good beer. I ran into Ken in line in the Widmer line because we just got the same beer. How do you like it? It's great. Very, very good. What is your New Year's resolution? You're going to laugh at me. I'm going to run the Portland Marathon next year. Now, why is that your resolution? Have you done it before? No, I haven't done it before. You know, we started running and that's something I want to do. It's a great city, a great place to run. What is your New Year's resolution? Hmm, get on TV at least once a month. Now's the time to actually try a chip, one of these beer chips she's been bragging about. Let's go. Very nice. Uh -huh. What's the difference between a holiday ale and a normal ale? We're going to go with you first, Josh. Well, a holiday ale is a little bit boozier than a normal ale. It's going to be darker, maltier, more full-bodied, good to keep you warm. What are you, a frickin' brewer? Yeah, I am actually. Are yeah. you serious? Yeah, I'm a home brewer. I love it. Dude, you're right on the yeah, money. I love, I love home brewing. I love beer, and I love Oregon has the best beer. But you live in Washington, dude. I know, but I still come over and drink the good beer. <laughs> Did you hear that, Washington? We have better beer. You were so much more lively before the camera went on. You know that, don't you? Sorry, I'm kind of shy. No, you're not. You were chasing us down to be on camera. What are you talking about? That was not me. <laughs> that was Josh. <laughs> All right. What is your New Year's resolution? Maybe to be like a better person and... Does that mean you're not a good person right now? I'm an okay person. Besides peace on earth and goodwill towards men is to brew a beer half as good as this one. Big Coast, do you live in, in Eugene, Oregon? Eugene, Oregon. I know, dude. Everybody says Oregon who's not from here. Does it piss you off? Uh, it used to, and then I got over it. <laughs> <laughs> so tell us about your beer. We've been brewing for Ninkasi since June, distributing since July, and so far uh, everyone has loved it. Hops is uh, a natural product here in the Pacific Northwest. 35% of the national hop crop is actually farmed here in the northern Willamette Valley. Making this style of beer for me is uh, one of the highest honors I can give to my community and as well, you know, to the history and the passion of beer. New Year's resolutions are abound and I think it was Ken who's going to run the marathon. Dude, good luck to you on that. Good luck to the rest of you in 2007. Peace out from the 2006 Holiday Ale Festival from Pioneer Square.